back Cause somebody stole it and put it in your head Hello everyone, you are welcome to my YouTube channel. I will the Finnish line begin before the World Cup and we are waiting for the last month of the competition. The most eventful and uh, exciting this weekend from August uh, 16 to 18. The World Challenge Cup in Minsk will be held. All the details in this video. And do not to forget to subscribe to the channel so as not to miss the most important interesting moments in the world of gymnastics before the World Cup. Gymnasts will again compete for the right to call themselves winner. And now in every team girls is competing for places in the World Cup. So it will be interesting to watch not only the Russian team. In Minsk gymnastics will play all around and individual types of medals among individual and group. Traditionally the first two days of August 16 and 17 will host all around events for seniors and group. The competitions will start on both days from 10 am on Sunday, August 18. The final medals will be played, gymnast will start performing at 1 pm and a gala concert will be held in the evening. For those who want to attend to the start of the good news, the World Cup stage will be held in the Rhythmic Gymnastics Palace in Minsk and admission is free. And it will be possible to see world starts there. Barana Kalein, Zohra Akhamirova, Victoria Naprienka, Milena Baldassari, Nivyana Vladinova, Nicole Zilkman, Katrin Galkina, Ksenia Mustafaeva, Adilat Likenova, Sabina Tashkenbaeva, Alexandra Ajajakuleze, Anastasia Salas. From the the national team of Ukraine, second gymnastic Kristina Pogranichina or Vlada Nikolchenko. One list is list Vlada and in another Kristina. Alina Dilhanova, who has not practiced for about two months, will also perform the athletes with injured and doctors forbade her from and physical activity. The World Cup stage in Minsk will be first start after the break. Well, we will wait for the closest fight among Israel gymnasts Lenoir Shram, which recovered after an injury and gymnast of the Russian team Dina and Arina Averina. In the group program we will also see some on the strongest teams from the national team of Russia, Ukraine, Japan, Bulgaria, Belarus, Azerbaijan, Italy and another equally interesting teams. We are promised a broadcast so those who can't attention can follow the links below in the description. Well, those who do not have time, you know where to find information about each competition day. Every day I will wait for you on the channel. Write in the comments who you will root for and who, in your opinion, will take the first medals. Well, remember that I love you and bye bye.